Good morning, my friends. How's everybody doing today? Let's address the elephant in the room. I am not wearing any makeup because it's bright and early and I'm working from home today. So you guys don't judge me. This is my real goodness to gracious face. So it is what it is. Today's video is going to be a little different. We're doing a vlog style video today. I'm excited to do something a little different. So it is currently Friday. I'm not sure what day this video is going to be posted, but right now it's Friday and we're just going to do a day in the life of a vintage and antique reseller slash eBayer. So I just dropped Tiny Human off at school and I got an email from somebody I'm not sure who. There's a local estate sale in my area. We just pulled up. It's like two minutes away from my house, which like that never happens. So there weren't any pictures or anything and it wasn't even on estatesales.net. So I'm not really sure what to expect, but this is the first stop of the day. Then we gotta go home and do some eBay things and some YouTube-y things. So without further ado, let's get this day started. You know I love these big trees. So pretty. And it's a very nice morning. Little chilly. This is the house we're going to. Not sure what to expect. Estate sale. That away. But beautiful yard. Love the trees. Just walked in. I already found yeah, I already found a table. You got it. This is really pretty. My flash went on. Wasn't expecting that. She's just so lazy. Oh, I love all these old books. This is pretty. It kind of looks like Gordy. Bear. Bear. Okay, we gotta move a little faster because it just opens. So. Excuse me, Miss Mark. <laughs> move your caboose. No, I'm just kidding. I'm not. I'm not taking. I don't video people. Ooh, that's pretty. Um, I have a YouTube channel. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, she's cute. I've actually had her before. She's supposed to be holding something. Here's some Christmas stuff. I don't. Some old, an old tree skirt. <gasps> Look at that banister bookcase. Sold. How is it sold? I'm the first person here. Conspiracy. So this is a lot of furniture. Don't want to film the lovely Miss Margaret. Thank you. You're welcome. I need to find the stuff stuff. I see a lot of furniture, but like I said, there weren't any pictures online, so I really didn't know what to expect. So, we're just looking around right now. I found the knickknackery of it all. This is what I was looking for. This is pretty. Scotch. Let's look over here. Oh, that's a pretty shelf. Here's the bottom of a refrigerator dish. Excuse me, love. I see some bunnies. Oh, that mouse is cute. And that little pink face. Those are cute. Department 56. And this is pretty. This ginger jar. Oh, it's Stangle. I might pick this up because I actually have a lighter that matches this. But there's no whole table, so you stay there, little Stangle. This is pretty too. Oh, that's really pretty. Handcrafted in Scotland. $3. Let me grab that. Boop. And then here's this little satin pink bud face. Just have a crack on the top. 
And look at this brass nails. He's cute. Two fifty made in Korea. I'm not sure on you, little mouse man. More than likely, India. Mm -hmm. Like these little plates, those are sweet. Five dollars for this set. And then there's this little pottery piece, and that's about all I see. All right, we're gonna go look in the other room. He's kinda cool. Hmm. Alright, let's go look in the other room. Going down to the basement now. I also got that little table right there. I'll show you guys in a second, but it's really cute. Here's the basement. Yeah, watch the steps. I like this little table. Can I get this table too? Can I get this table too? Sure. I'm buying the other table upstairs. Yeah. Thank you. Ooh, I like this. Free! Love that. Y'all, if you go in here, uh -huh. be very, very, very careful. The floor is going to be ripped out and it, it will fall through. I mean, it's not going to fall through for about four or five inches. Okay, but the question is, are we allowed to sue? Yeah, well, yes. Perfect. Sue, then I'm going. I'm just, you got plenty of money? You want to be best friends? <laughs> yeah. I'm just kidding. Let me see if I can win There's some old records. Oh, I like this little bird cage. There's You're a cute bird cage. These are great to put plants in. Might get this too. That's my stuff. Look at the little bike. That's cute. Oh, and look at the old roller skates. That was uh, my mother in law's. Did you already bring the table up? I said it. Oh, I was like, you're so fast. I want these two. Okay. That table's five dollars, or is it sold? I'm confused. What does it say? I can't. I can't read. Five dollars. Dang. Y'all are. Oh my gosh! Look at this. This is so good. I love this. Okay, this is sold too. What is? It? Is it? Did it say so? No, I mean I'm no. I'm buying it. Okay, yeah. But um, I have to come back with the truck. Yeah, okay. But I want this. Yeah. Please. What's your name? Ariana. Ariana. Yeah, what, what, I want this name? too. That's a great name. I need a lot of sold stickers. Yeah, yeah let me go tell. <laughs> I oh. have to, um, I just guys. built a new office. I'm going to show you guys that very soon. But I'm going to buy that. And I'm going to buy that. And I'm going to get that all for my new office. I love them. And this is five. I'm obsessed with it. And then this one, $5. And then look at this one. Oh, I'm so happy. And you know how much this one is? Do, 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 do. Free. Heck yeah. Super happy. I really needed shelving. So I'm really, really happy. Really happy. <laughs> so the beginning of this vlog is turning out pretty good. I did good there. I mean, I didn't get a lot of like small stuff. I got that Stangle pottery piece. Uh, I got a cool nutcracker and some old books. One has a pixie in it, so I'm excited about that. But I got a lot of furniture. I'm really, really happy with those shelves because my husband was gonna build me shelves for my new office, but with the price of wood right now, that was way cheaper to just get those. And those are so much more my aesthetic than like brand new shelving. So I'm really happy about that. 
And like I said before, that estate sale wasn't even on estatesales.net. Someone sent me an email privately. So thank you to whomever that was. But that was so good. And those prices were really good too. Like that one shelf was free. I mean, what's cheaper than free? And they were so nice to me. So I'm in my Jeep and all that stuff clearly was not going to fit in my Jeep. So I'm taking the first load home of like the smaller tables I bought and then I'm getting the truck and then we're going to go back and get those. So I'll see you guys then. <laughs> it's a little challenging, but we got them in. Not bad for 10 bucks. They need a little cleaning, but nothing we can't. As you can see, we are now in the truck and I got them. I got them. We got them. My hands hurt a little. Ooh. But we got them. It wasn't that hard. It was a little hard. Um, backing up though, that's going to be the hard part because I can't really see, but we're not too far from home. <laughs> so I'll see you guys at home and hopefully I can show you what these look like in my office. Now I do have to clean them, so that might take me a minute, but they're going to look great. So I'll see you guys at home. Get at home. Hip hip hooray. Here is the before of all the pieces. Now this one, the back is pretty uh, molded, kind of gross, but that's just like cheap plywood. So I'm just gonna bang that out and wash this with a lot, a lot of bleach and water. And then this one's not in bad shape at all. So here's the before of all of my bees. And then I'll show you guys the after. I just hosed this one down and then I completely covered it in bleach. I'm letting it soak in. A lot of that black stuff that you see is like tarry stuff from where they were storing their cleaning supplies on, but I'm sure it's going to clean up really well. And don't worry, um, I'm using a lot of bleach. And as you can see, I also knocked off the back to get rid of all of that gross stuff. So I'm just going to let it soak in the sun for a little bit and then we'll get back to this. Oh, all right. I've been out here for about mm, an hour and a half and look how good they cleaned up. So here's this one. I have it laying flat in the sun just to help disinfect with that. Oh, look how dirty my suckies are. But I have this out disinfecting. It cleaned up really good. See all those spots are gone. Look how dirty my hands are. Ooh. But yeah, cleaned up really nice. And then I have this one over here, all bleached out, cleaned up also really nice, also laying flat, letting the sun, you know, hit the bleach and let it air out. And then the big mamma jamma. This one cleaned up so nice. And what I did was I took off this top um, that was like all warped and stuff. And then under it is this beautiful wood so that cleaned up really super nice really happy about that um yeah i think i think everything is going to plan so yay everything is clean now we must go inside and do some more work before we have to pick up tiny human so that actually ate into my morning quite a bit um that's the life of a reseller though you never really know what you're getting yourself into you never know what you're gonna find at an estate sale so I tell you guys all the time that my brain works like if you give a mouse a cookie. Like, that's literally how my brain works. I plan on doing one thing and I find something else and oi oi oi. Anyways, we are in my very crowded basement office. Um, I am moving offices, as I've told you guys, so I'm super excited about that. Um, but now we are getting into the YouTube of it all. That is the next thing we have. So I do have a live sale every Tuesday night at 7.30 p.m. Eastern, where I sell anywhere from 30 to 35 vintage and antique items. But this last Tuesday was a little bit different because I dropped some merch. I was so excited. You guys sold it out. So thank you so much. I still can't believe it. But um, with that being said, we had our regular 34 items plus 17 shirts. So I had quite a few items to ship an invoice for. Um, I got all the packaging done on Wednesday and I sent out invoices is first thing Thursday morning. Now it's time <coughs> to see who all paid and ship them out. And then when I go to pick up Tiny Human from school, I will drop them off at the post office. So I'll show you guys the packages. 
Please excuse the mess. It's I'm moving, so it's a work in progress. But here is all the wonderful packages that we have to ship out today. Again, I can't thank you guys enough for all of your support. I am beyond grateful for each and every one of you. So next thing is to do is to print. Next thing to do is to print out all the shipping labels on these and get them to the post office. And voila, just like that, they're in the car. <laughs> I know I skipped a big step in between, but here they are. They're all ready to go. Next stop is the post office. This is an exact instance of a reseller life. So I have to go to the post office before I pick up Tiny Human from school. But I got all this stuff without a state sale today. So what did I do? I just set it here on my driveway until I can come back home and put it all away. It's a beautiful day, so it'll be fine. And honestly, I got most of it out of the basement, so it wouldn't be too terrible for it to air out anyways. So when we get home, we have to put these away and all of our new furniture. I live in a really small town and they are so nice. They always let me drop my packages off at this like back entrance so I don't have to carry them all in the front. So that is awesome. But now we just have to drop our packages off. While we're here, we might as well check my P.O. box. P.O. box 563. That's me. Oh, oh my goodness. I actually have something. I really, I really didn't think I was going to. I don't know what it is. Let's see. Box 11. I really wasn't expecting anything. I thought it was going to be empty. Box 11. Where are you? Here we go. <laughs> don't show the person. Let's see if it was. I don't know. It's from Amazon. Peculiar. I kind of want to open this. Um, I don't know if it's from one of my friends or if it's something I ordered and it got sent to my P.O. box on accident. Well, we're going to find out. I don't know what it is. Definitely a gift. Who is this from? Who got? Dear Ariana, these books are for you to read to Eloise. These are the first three of a series that I adored as a little girl. Hope you both love them too. XO Karen Rogers. Oh, Karen, you stinker. That is so nice. And actually, Karen doesn't know that I actually, I love these books. I don't have new ones. I have older ones and I actually bought one today at that estate sale, which is so, I swear me and Karen, we have like ESPN or something, but look how cute, I have goosebumps. Look, a gift from the lonely doll. I have this one too, but like the older one that I probably wouldn't let my daughter play with because it's kind of musty. So these are great, the lonely doll. And Edith and Mr. Bear, I'm pretty sure this is the one I got today. I have to, when I go home, I'll look and see if this is the one I got today. But I can't believe it, Karen, you stinker. These are so good. How did you know? I love these. Look at the images. Mm, I can't wait to read these to Eloise. Thank you so much, Karen. Y'all don't ever have to send me anything to my P.O. box, but it sure does make me happy. Thank you, Karen. Thank you, thank you. I got home and this is the one I bought today. How funny is that, Karen? So, thank you. I love this that. This vlog is seriously all over the place. But then again, honestly, so is my life. Organized chaos, as I say. Um, just dropped small human off at home with daddy. And now we're going to meet up with the lovely young lady that helped me make my merch. Because she has a new order for me so I'm really excited to pick those up so now we're gonna head there we're gonna pick that up um, and then I might go get my car cleaned because it's filthy from picking up that stuff from the estate sale so I think I might do that and then we're gonna come home and put everything away oh it's a, this is how every day is busy 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 well I'm in my 
my new office. I was going to show you guys the furniture in here and how it looks and everything, but then I decided I'm going to wait and do the office tour reveal for another video. So I am going to end today's vlog here. Uh, still lots more to do before the night is upon us. But thank you guys so much for joining me for this very random vlog of a day in the life of me. But thank you guys so much again for joining me at the Withering Cottage. Bye, guys. <laughs>